guys i just woke up it's 6 am in the morning and uh, welcome to my morning routine video so in this video i'm going to be showing you my productive weekend morning routine hope you guys enjoy welcome again to my channel so uh, i have actually recently posted a poll on uh, what video should i post next so i thought majority of the people they just voted for a productive morning routine which i am filming on the process and this i'm shooting in between so um, this particularly for students that um, i have followed this routine my whole student life number one i hmm, sleep early and wake up early so uh, sleeping early and waking up early is very very important um, so if you sleep early uh, you will be able to wake up early also so you will also feel fresh and you feel more productive so this is what i follow so i sleep by like 11 i think 11 is kind of early for me so 11 11 20 i sleep and then i wake up at uh, 5 or uh, 5 30 max and then sometimes six also to be honest so that depends on my mood and uh, the need so uh, just wake up early in the morning and uh, and then just start your day with something productive just uh, do your incomplete works or do your studying things so i mostly all do all my incomplete works my studying works everything in the morning so that's very very effective and while you do this just try it and you feel the productive the whole day so i highly highly recommend that habit and then do some yoga and meditation i was not able to film it today but uh, i would like to mention it now so uh, yoga and meditation is very important to keep your mind calm and uh, composed you will feel a peace within yourself so do try that out also so i actually follow a video which i'll put it in the description box down below the video of that, uh, of that particular link so that actually uh, like i love that it's nothing too much or nothing low it's like perfectly balanced kind of uh, yoga video so i would recommend that and uh, yeah that's the main part i would like to say so i have talked much so let's jump into the video again so my cupboard is like very very messy recently so it's been a while since i cleaned it so i'm gonna be doing it today so let's start I feel it, you don't mean it Why you sad right now? I gotta feel it, gotta feel it There's something about your eyes
I finally arranged my cupboard <laughs> and it took like uh, two hours to do all my arranging things and to clean my shoes and bags. So I have arranged it in a color order but <laughs> to be honest within a month everything is going to change. It doesn't look like this. It's just for my satisfaction that I have arranged it in this way. But anyway for now it looks good but uh, <laughs> after like few weeks everything is going to be shuffled. So yeah this is how I tried it today. And this is how my cupboard ended up. So it's been a week. I have not oiled my hair. So let's oil my hair. Okay. I'll show you one more thing. I use this particular oil. This you will not get it in any shop. So I have. I think I've mentioned in my previous video also. This is a homemade oil. So we just add all the ingredients and make our own oil. Rather than getting it uh, commercially from the shop. It actually causes more harm than good. Uh, trust me. So go like... Like, so it's not like that difficult to make just put some coconut oil and then put all the ingredients like aloe vera amla and uh, curry leaves all those healthy ingredients which is responsible for hair growth you can also add small onions so mix all these boil them and make your own oil so this is like similar kind of ingredients so please use a natural hair oil rather than going with the commercial ones if you're going if you are lazy making it so you can go for commercial oils but Make sure you watch the ingredient list so that it, it doesn't cause more harm than good. So, take this tip. Hey everyone, so I just took a shower and then just came back. So my morning routine is over and I have to study after this. I have exam tomorrow and I have to study. So that's all for my routine and a few tips that I would love to give you guys uh, for more good morning routine is that do journaling every day. Like whatever you feel like uh, writing just write on the note and it actually empties your uh, mind and then you feel like calm and uh, composed. So I highly recommend to write journal. Then after that, uh, make sure you and also make sure you plan your day out. So to-do list is one of the most important thing that I have uh, always been following it since uh, I was in school. So to-do list is something that is need to be followed, especially for students because you have so much things to do every single day and you need to plan that out properly. Only then your tasks are completed. So for example, I can show you one second. Wait. So I have listed out the things that my uh, the things that I have to do so that uh, it will be always like stuck in front of me so that I will never forget what to do so you can just do it like this also or you can also maintain a separate note for it I was doing it in a separate note but later on I switched to sticky notes so whatever you have to do I just stick it here so that I will never forget things so I think in this way you can also accomplish tasks and you will never forget what you have to do for the day so I think this is the number one tip I would love to give you. So every morning I, I just write down the task for the day and then I just stick it out until I complete it. So this is another good tip for students and it's been working for me since years, like so many years. So I would highly recommend to do this. One more tip that I would love to give you is that uh, drink lots of water in the morning. So uh, keep yourself, uh, make yourself hydrated from the morning. So it's very, very important to drink lots of water, especially in the morning. So that um, it's just needed. So do that, especially the summer is just coming and then it's very, very hot recently. So drink lots of water. So I've <laughs> forgotten to add the clips of it, but now I'm mentioning it. So don't forget. So that's all for this video. So I have covered my weekend morning routine. So this is what I do every weekend. So yeah. I'll meet you in the next video. So I'll connect another poll or post another poll. So just choose which video you want to see next. And uh, or you also can also comment down in the comment section down below on what video you have to, uh, what video you want from me next. So until then, it's Archana Shivakumar signing off. I got a feeling.